Okay guys, welcome to the next day of February day here. I thought it might be kind of fun to complete the loop. We did uh, 7-Eleven, Lawson, Family Mart, and I was like, yeah, I gotta hit up the Daily Store. And as you may recall from last year's video, I visited the Daily Store. They kind of specialize in sort of their bakery section. They always advertise that they have you know, freshly made <laughs> baked goods on display. And they have an, a little alcove area where you can get uh, specifically baked goods. So I went in there looking around for something. I didn't, I wasn't really thinking to get something sweet this time. However, I was a little surprised to see that they actually had cinnamon rolls. If you remember my video from a week or two ago, I was like, cinnamon rolls are really kind of rare here in Japan. Well, since I posted that video, someone else told me that they found some cinnamon rolls at 7-Eleven and now I just found some in the fresh baked area of the daily store. But I decided not to get it since I've already tried those. But since I was in the mood for something more a little savory, I kind of looked around. They had, they did have fresh baked rolls and things, but they were pretty plain. There was a curry, curry pan, curry bread that was, that looked all right. Um, they had some pizzas that looked horrendous though, but what I did end up getting is this here This is a fish sandwich <laughs> Essentially, so uh, let's see if this is gonna hit the spot or not. I wouldn't say it's a hot dog roll But it's a hot dog shaped roll. There you go Kope pan is what they're calling it and uh, Okay, it's got a, a slender piece of fish fried fish in there as well as some tartar sauce. It doesn't look to be, you know, oh, maybe it's just mayo. I was going to say it doesn't look to be uh, like a pickly kind of tartar sauce. And then just for effect, they've got some lettuce poking out the side there. Yeah, it's kind of hard to show you without dropping too much of it. But there we go. Yeah, <laughs> there's not much going on here. There is some sauce, like that brown stuff there. There's just some kind of sauce sauce in japan they say sauce it's sort of like a brown sauce but not quite um let's see let's check out the price here it was 165 and for some reason i got 20 20 yen off when i bought it i don't know maybe it's been sitting out all day there were a few things that did look as though they were sitting out all day but uh yeah let's get into this itadakimasu I was about to say this is going to blow McDonald's filet of fish out of the water. However, at least McDonald's filet of fish is warm, <laughs> which this isn't. It's not cold, it's just room temperature. And uh, yeah, maybe the 20, 20 yen off was because it, it was maybe made earlier today and has been sitting out for a few hours. I'm getting a bit of tartar sauce now really uh really helps but yeah overall not not great i mean this is cheap enough right quick little sandwich and maybe you drive down the road it's not going to be too messy if you're eating as you drive so i mean at least i can see some positives in this and my usual drink i'm gonna say i haven't totally given up on the daily store i just need to time it better when i go there where things are just freshly put out unfortunately this time of year like I, I finish work and i have a small window where there's still a bit of daylight so i don't really have much flexibility however i also found some potato chips in there that i thought looked kind of interesting and you can see what they're called here it's ma 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 mustard so ma 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 mustard super delicious flavor the shape of the packaging is unique, isn't it? Usually the seal is like at the top of the package, but it's on the side. And they've got, uh, these are potato chips, by the way, in case I didn't mention that, even though it says super potato right here. Um, but yeah, they, they on the side here, it's saying to open them across the top and then the bottom, you can set them up and just like a little bowl, I guess. So uh, let's do that, if we can, come on. Okay, in all fairness, is there a little, oh here it is, 
is a spot that where you can tear it. Or can you? There we go. Okay. I was gonna say, in all fairness, the the picture shows a pair of scissors. Okay, so this is what we got. I'll try to show you inside. Yay, potato chips. Hmm, interesting smell coming off there. So the idea would be to they would sit on your table like that, and you can just eat them. <laughs> I guess you'd have two hands free for whatever else you were trying to do. But they don't look uh, they don't look like much other than potato chips. So let's give this a shot and see if it is, as they say, super delicious flavor. Hmm. These are actually pretty tasty. A little, a little bit of a sharp mustard flavor, but it's working like as a seasoning, it's kind of a little bit tangy. Hmm. Yeah, I like these. They're pretty tasty. All right, they're super delicious. Now, if you gave them to me without telling me they were ma 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 mustard, I probably wouldn't be able to uh, to guess. <laughs> That's what it was. But yeah, a nice tangy flavor. So I'm gonna set them down, and I got my two hands free now. I'm going to soup up this fish sandwich. Some chips. Chuck them in there. Oh! Oh no! Even with two hands free, he manages to drop a bunch of chips. I guess I'm overstuffing this. Give me some crunch here. There we go. There we go. All right. There we go. They were just too big. So, <laughs> here we go. Mmm. I like it. Some of the tartar sauce and the mustard chips are magically giving me a sort of Big Mac sauce experience. A nice crunch. See, overall, not not bad. I really like the addition of the uh, super potato chips. If you're in Japan and you've tried the daily store baked goods, let me know your experience. What would you recommend that I should try to get if I go back there again? So that's it for this video. I'm gonna finish this off, pick up the stray chips that have fallen. <laughs> Head on my way. So I just want to say thanks for watching today. If you're new here, please subscribe. Don't forget to thumb up this video and ring that dinner bell so you don't miss my next video. And uh, we'll see you guys in the next one.